At this time, I'd like to call up Catherine Snyder. She'll be um, sworn in by her brother, Damien Belgica. Mm -hmm. Ten in the Bible, you need to write down. Mm -hmm. I state your name. You solemnly swear that I will support the Constitution of the United States and the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. To the governments established in the United States. Established in the United States and in this state, and in this state, under the authority of the people, under the authority of the people, and that I will faithfully, impartially, and justly, and that I will faithfully, impartially, and justly perform all duties of the office of councilwoman, perform all duties of the office of councilwoman, according to the best of your ability, according to the best of your ability. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Can you hear her working microphone? Hello. Yes. The next item on the agenda is a resolution filling the vacancy in the governing body pursuant to NJSA 40A colon 16 1 at SEC. And first, I'll hand this portion of the meeting over to you. Sherry, did you re reference me? I couldn't hear you. Yes. Um, okay. Just read the resolution filling the vacancy, the governing body pursuant to NJSA 40A 16 1 at SEC. And then I'm handing it to you um, to handle nominations. Sure, there would either um, need to be a nomination for that position or some other action on the resolution or the agenda. It's up mm -hmm. to the governing body how it wants to proceed. Do 
we have a nomination for the vacancy? I nominate Michael Batista. Oh, uh, yeah. Do I have a second, second nomination for Michael Batista? I believe Councilwoman, Councilwoman Davis seconded it. Um, under Robert's rules, generally, motions or nominations don't need a second, but that's fine. There's nothing improper if someone wanted to make a second. And now, um, are there any other nominations? Okay, if there's no other nominations, then a vote would be in order. So I have a motion filling the vacancy of the governing body with Michael Batista. I'll make a motion. Our second. second. And now roll call vote. Mrs. Baumler? Yes. Dr. Davis? Yes. Mrs. Lambert? Um, yes, I had a concern uh, with Mr. Batista not living in town all year round, but he has assured me that that would not be an issue. And uh, his expertise and experience, um, I do think, will come into play. So, yes. Thank you. Ms. Snyder. Yes. Okay. So that motion carries, and Mr. Batista mm -hmm. is selected to fill the vacancy. That vacancy, due to the expiration of the term at the end of 2024 will continue until there will be a special election to fill the remainder of the term this November. And upon certification of that election to fill the remainder of the term, that individual would take the seat from the certification date of the November 23 election until the end of the term of December 31st, 2024. Thank you. Mr. Batista, you could come forward. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Mike Batista from Southern Square, that I will support the Constitution of the United States and the Constitution of the state of New Jersey, that it will bear truth, faith, and allegiance to the same to the governments established in the United States and in this state under the authority of the people, and that I will faithfully, impartially, and justly perform all the duties of the office of councilman. Here. Ms. Snyder. Here. At this time, we'll be taking nominations for the Office of Mayor. Do we have a nomination for the Office of Mayor? I'd like to nominate Nancy Davis for the Office of Mayor. Any other nominations? I'd like to nominate Colleen Lambert for the Office of Mayor. Any other nominations for mayor? Okay, at this time I'll take a roll call for the nomination of Nancy Davis as mayor. Mr. Batista. What's are we voting on? As for Nancy Davis as mayor. Yes, would be a vote for me if he gave us as mayor. Yes. 
Mrs. Baumiller. No. Dr. Davis. Yes. Ms. Lambert. No. Ms. Snyder. Yes. First, there's three yeses, two no's. That roll call is confirmed. Motion before. carries as a, a majority of the governing body pursuant to the statute governing this 4069A 86. At this time, I'll take a nomination for the uh, nomination of council president. I nominate Jamie Bell Miller. Any other nominations for council president? I nominate Kitty Snyder. Any other nominations for council president? On the nomination of Jamie Baumiller as council president, I'll take a roll call. Mr. Batista. Yes. Mrs. Baumiller. Is this for you? Yes. <laughs> yes. Dr. Davis. Yes. Ms. Lambert. Yes. Ms. Snyder. I'm sorry, this is for Jamie Valley, Council President. Oh, excuse me, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I thought you were. My, my nomination was for Katie Snyder. So procedurally, we followed the first nomination. Um, just clarify for the record that th this vote, Sherry, is for Ms. Baumiller as mayor. So if someone made an error, if someone made an error in voting, they can fix that. Do you want me to roll call again? Yes. Okay. Just clarify the, the motion for Please. the record. This is a motion to approve Ms. Baumiller as council president. Yes, that was stated on the record. <clears throat> for the motion, for the nomination of Jamie Baumiller as council president. Mr. Batista. No. Mrs. Baumiller. Yes. Dr. Davis. Uh, no. Ms. Lambert. Yes. Ms. Snyder. No. Since that was not a majority, now you should move to the next nomination. For the nomination of Catherine Snyder as council president. Mr. Batista. Yes. Ms. Bob Miller. No. <coughs> Dr. Davis. Yes, yes. Ms. Lambert. No. Yes, did you? I got you, Nancy. Ms. Snyder. Yes. Three yeses. So that motion carries. Thank you. For tonight, is, are we um, conducting an open office for Mayor Davis via Zoom? I would do it via Zoom and then repeat it when she is present again in person to sign the paperwork. Okay. Dr. Davis, if you could raise your right hand. I, Nancy Davis. I, Nancy Davis. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. And the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. And the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. So, would you repeat that? I'm sorry, I didn't get it. Bear true faith and allegiance to the same. True faith and allegiance to the same. To the governments established in the United States. To the government established in the United States. In this state. In the state. Under the authority of the people. Under the authority of the people. People. That I will faithfully. That I will faithfully. 
impartially and justly impartially and justly perform all the duties of the office of mayor perform all the duties of the office of mayor according to the best of my ability according to the best of my abilities so help me god so help me god congratulations <clears throat> Thank you. The next order of business is resolution 2022-28, authorizing the hiring of Gabriel R. Murray as a temporary entry-level police officer for the DJ Police Department. I'd like to ask um, Chief Markowski to come up and uh, say a few words. Okay. All right. Uh, Gabriel Murray is a resident of Wardertown and a graduate of Southern Regional High School. Gabe graduated the Academy of Law and Public Safety as a Class One police officer and attended Ocean County College. He began with Beach Haven as a Class One officer in 2020. Gabe attended the Ocean County Police Academy and graduated April 2022 with a Class Two certification. Gabe is bilingual, has volunteered with the Beach Haven PAL program at the Beach Haven Elementary School, shows great interest in being involved in community programs. Gabe is also a volunteer coach at the Stafford Lacrosse Club. Uh, we would uh, greatly appreciate uh, hiring Gabe. Uh, I think he'd be a great asset to our department and uh, look forward to working with him. And I think everybody would be happy with the type of person. Any questions from the council chief about this appointment? No. Is Gabe here? Yes. Yeah. Well, he would be here. Sure, we need the vote. Oh, I'm sorry. Resolution 2020 28, authorizing the hire of Gabriel R. Murray as a temporary entry level police officer for the Haven Police Department. So I have. I, I make a motion. We accept 2022-28. Second. I'll second. second. Okay. Uh, Mr. Batista? Yes. Mrs. Donnell? Yes. Oh, Colleen Lambert? Yes. Uh, Mrs. Snyder? Yes. Yeah. And Mayor Davis? Yes. Aye. 
take your name. I give her a marine. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. <clears throat> that I will support the Constitution of the United States. And the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. And the Constitution of the the state of New Jersey. That I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. So bear true faith and allegiance to the same. To the government established in the United States. To the government established in the United States. And in this state. And in this state. Under the authority of the people. And under the authority of the people. That I will faithfully, impartially, and justly perform. And that I will faithfully, impartially, and justly perform. All the duties of the office of. All the duties of the office of. The government. The government. According to the best of my ability. According to the best of my ability. So help me God. So help me God. <laughs> Thank you. Welcome aboard. The families want to get a couple pictures and some of them. Well, though we can give you a few minutes to do that before we move forward. Come on up. Congratulations. 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 Good to have you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thanks, Thank you. Thank you. All matters listed under item consent agenda are considered to be routine by the council and will be enacted by one motion in the form listed. Any items requiring expenditure are supported by a certification of availability of funds, and any item requiring discussion will be removed from the consent agenda and discussed separately. All consent agenda items will be reflected in full in the minutes. Resolution number one is the annual meeting notice for 2023. Number two, naming check signers. Number three, adopting Robert's rules of order. Number four, acknowledging managerial appointments. Those are the GIF fund commissioner, uh, the uh, public agency compliance officer. Number five is awarding professional service contract below 17,500. And number six is awarding our professional services contract that exceeds 17,500. Number seven is acknowledging managerial appointments to the Historic Preservation Advisory Commission. Number eight, acknowledging mayoral appointments to the Library Board of Trustees. Number nine is authorized authorization of the municipal tax assessor or municipal attorney as agent in filing petitions of appeal or complaint. Number 10, adopting a cash management plan. Number 11, acknowledging managerial appointments to the land use board. Number 12, acknowledging managerial class one, class two, and class three appointments for the land use board. 13 is appointing certifying officers for the division of pension and benefits. 14, establishing the 2023 fees for special services. 15, fixing the rate of interest to be charged on delinquent taxes and water. 16, identifying more accurately the prosecutor roster. 17, approving resident requests for additional handicap parking. 18, appointing a tax and assessment search officer. 19, authorizing the tax collector to conduct an electronic tax sale. 
20 is our declaration of civil rights. 21, establishing fees for tax sale notices. 22 is adopting a temporary budget. 23, designating an authorized signatory for certified lists of 200 foot radius. 24, executing an agreement with Regina Latito for social media marketing services. 25, executing an agreement with Bonnie Wells for marketing and website services. 26, authorizing cancellation the tax and water balances below $10. 27, authorizing execution of a Schedule C agreement with Ocean County to provide road and engineering services. And finally, number 29, authorizing a change fund for use of various offices. At this time, I do think that a couple of these should be removed from the consent agenda, considering that I have not been able to um, speak to Mayor Davis about some of the appointments. So I think that um, number eight. Um, number eight is library board of trustees appointments and those are mayoral appointments. So I would like some time to discuss that before putting that on the agenda. And that's just to clarify, number 11, the class one member is the mayor. So our class one member will be Nancy Davis. The class two member would be Tom Middle. And the class three member, um, assuming is Jamie, should I assume that? Jamie Bellmiller? Yes. <laughs> Any other concerns from council about the resolutions in the consent agenda? Are you removing 11? I, I am not. I'm just, in, unless, I mean, I'm, I'm informing you that class one is Nancy Davis as mayor. Class two is. Is that 12 or 11? This is 11. Oh, I'm sorry. I have it backwards. You're right. 12. And then the class three would be a member of council, but um, that's for you all to decide. Does anybody else want to be on the language board? I'm, I'm happy with 12. I just, my question mm -hmm. is, are you removing 11? I am removing number 12, number eight, and number 12. So 11 is the acknowledging managerial accordance to the land use board. Correct. And 12 is also acknowledging those same appointments. I'm confused. Okay, let me just take a second here. 11 are the mate of the general members of the land use board. And then I wouldn't have to remove either one because after clarifying that class one would be the mayor, class two, Tom Meadow, class three, Jamie Bow Miller, it would not need to be removed if you don't have anyone else. So only eight, does that clarify? Yes, thank you. Okay. Do I have a motion to approve the consent agenda items with the exception of number eight? I'll make a motion. Do I have a second? Second. Second. Mr. Batista? Yes. Mrs. Fahmiller? Yes. Dr. Davis? Yes. Ms. Lambert? Yes. Ms. Snyder? Yes. That is all I have at the moment. At this time, we can open the floor for public comment. Any person in the audience would like to speak on any topic, you can come to the microphone. State your name and address for the record. Anyone on Zoom wish to be heard during public comment? Can speak on any topic? Just raise an electronic hand. Seeing none, we'll close the floor. No final remarks by council. Mr. Batista. I'm excited to be able to help out. Do you this have year. a microphone that works? I'm, I'm excited. Thank you for the appointment. And I'm very excited to be able to help out uh, this year. I don't know how best to communicate with the public, 
but uh, I'll figure that out if we want to do. Uh, I don't have a social media or Twitter page or something. I don't know what council is doing right now to reach out to the public. But I think it's important that everybody is informed, everybody has a voice, and we all work together to solve problems. Mrs. Baumiller. Um, thank you. for volunteering. I look forward to working with you this year. And I year. look forward to working with you. There's a lot to be done. And also, thank you to the public for uh, electing me. I'm very grateful for the public and everyone on council for giving me this opportunity to serve you, and I will do the best that I can for the next four years serving you and being your voice. Thank you. Dr. Davis. Uh, yes, I, I, I thank you. Uh, can, can you hear me? Can you yes. hear me? Yes. Uh, yeah, I, 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 I want to, um, I want to, I'm thrilled to be mayor again, and I'm thrilled to have Michael on the council, uh, adding some diversity, uh, and, and his experience will be valuable as well. I'm excited to work with all of you. I know Colleen and Jamie will uh, be great team members and let's try to work together as a team and continue fighting for the best for Beach Haven. Thank you. Ms. Lambert. Yes, Happy New Year, everybody. Um, as always, I will continue to work in the best interest of the town. I feel that people be in office for a certain reason and I will continue to work in that direction. Looking forward to working with everybody in the council and uh, like I said, Happy New Year, moving forward. Ms. Snyder. Thank you. Um, Michael, thank you for volunteering. Can you have a microphone? Oh, closer. Michael, thank you for volunteering. Um, and from the board, I look forward to learning a lot from you, as well as from Jamie, Colleen, and Nancy. Um, I'd like to thank all of you, uh, my friends and neighbors, who have entrusted me with this honor to serve each haven. I promise to boldly do the best I can and always uh, keeping each Haven's best interests at heart. Thank you very much. All right, at this time, do I have a motion to adjourn? So moved. Second. Second. Thank you. All right, everybody. Thank you. Meeting adjourned. Thank you. Thank you.